Okay, howdy folks. So it's uh, step 11, although we've kind of cheated and did this step most of the way through anyway. So, um, so right now we should just have three connections left over. Uh, if you don't, uh, I'll, I'll quickly run through how the other connections, so if you've got a bunch of wires hanging off back here, uh, I will run through really quickly where everything goes to. But uh, for the most part, you should already have these in place. Now, okay, so here you see most of the wires in place. Uh, so this is the X motor, this is the Y motor, this is the Z motor, this is the extrusion motor. So we'll go ahead and pop that right in there. So the blue wire that you see going in there, that is the thermistor going on the and this is the thermistor going to the hot end. So hot bed, hot end, hot bed, hot end. So reset button, hot bed, hot end thermistor. And you can tuck the rest back behind there really quick. Okay, and then what I recommend uh, for the hot end connector, again, so you've got a little square opening through here. You can possibly see my finger sticking through. That's where we've put the power connector and the hot end connector already. So I'm going to just feed that through there. You may need to use some sort of tool to kind of help you get through there, but Generally, it's, it's not too bad. Um, so I just fed it straight through. You can see it's, it's not too bad of a fuzz. All right, so I pulled it through. Okay, so down here, uh, the big connector that you see is the power connector. Uh, we've got the hot end connector and the hot bed connector. Now, on the original instructions, we flipped up the hot end and the hot bed connector. So, uh, just be sure to flip that back if you see that. Uh, so basically, hot bed, hot end, power connector. Hot bed, hot end, power connector. Okay, so hot end. Plug it in right there on that header. Everybody's happy. Now, uh, just as a just to complete all the connections, in case you are seeing this in the beginning and you haven't already done this. Uh, so basically, X, Y, Z limit switch. This is a E stop header, uh, which we don't use uh, in our electronics. And this is the USB connector. Uh, SD, micro SD. Um, these here are, sorry, one, two, three, four. So X, Y, Z, E um, trim, trim pods. So they basically they uh, regulate the amount of power that's going to the motors. So um, I think that's it for this this stuff. So. Uh, I'm just going to quickly bundle this in uh, to finish cleaning all that up as we go. Backward. 
hurts so that it doesn't actually zip it. So you can take it out and put it back in. I'm going to go ahead and trim these up. Okay, that's, that's it for this. Okay, so that's it for step 11 on this step 12.